is good family family welcome back to another fucking youtube video man so pretty much just a chill day um just wanted to show y'all a little before of my hair and shit i'm about to go get my cut i don't even really know what i look like on camera but um i just pulled up to the shop i couldn't park in the parking lot so i had to park in the gas station parking lot and shit like that but yeah y'all um so i'm about to head in there um i'm gonna try to record my cut if i can and yeah um before this video start make sure y'all like comment subscribe on the vlog and we out this bitch Yee! <laughs> Yeah, I also didn't give y'all a fit check, so I'm gonna just give y'all a little quick fit check right now. We got on the, uh, the Guap Garden hoodie. Uh, I got these pants from Boohoo Man. If y'all want to know my plug, well, it's not really a plug, but yeah, I got these pants from Boohoo Man, and then I got my Asics on the feet. So, calm a little fit today, nothing too crazy. But yeah, we about to walk in the shop. Usually, like my cuts, I usually get like a high taper fade type shit. So yeah, I'm gonna try to, like I said, I'm gonna try to record my cut and shit like that. But yeah. I'm about to walk into the shop. What's good, bro? Hey, what's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Yeah, yeah. Check this out. 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 Yeah, say what's up to the vlog, what's man. What's good, baby? You know what I'm saying? Zero. What's good? 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 Yo, why do you why do you got the camera on me? What you mean? You know what I'm saying? You get to your... Is that gonna be down at the bottom? Y'all know what's up. What's up, boy? Tell him. Yeah, I just started this, you know? Yeah, I just started before. Yeah, I'm gonna be right back. Like I said, I'm gonna try to record my cut. Yeah, yeah. We come and trim today. We come and trim. Which drink, which drink should I grab, y'all? Usually, like, I might grab, like, the turkey hill joints like the lemonade iced tea joints like these joints thorough for old i should grab this raspberry snapple yo if y'all don't know nothing about raspberry snapple bro listen grab this shit right here this is probably the best bag that y'all going uh that y'all going grab bro. i ain't gonna lie and i should grab like i need to stop eating some flower seeds and shit i need to stop eating so much stuff with salt in them so, I don't know. Should I get these, y'all? Should I get these, let me know down in the comments if y'all eat sunflower seeds. I should grab these joints, right? I'ma grab these joints, fuck it. Yeah, I'ma grab these joints. 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 Yeah, I'ma grab these they just came up with like all these nasty ass flavors. Like, bro, pizza, what the fuck? Who is eating pizza flavored Pringles, bro? Bro, if I catch y'all niggas eating pizza flavored Pringles, I'm whooping your ass, bro. That shit, gangsta. Yo, ever since I turned 21, bro, I've been going to stores, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I can't show y'all the backwards on camera because YouTube, uh, it's TOS, so I can't show y'all. But every time I go to stores now, I pull out my ID every time, like, I uh, I get backwards and I let them scan it because I'm hyped as shit. I'm 21. Since I turned 21, like, shit don't feel, like, no different. Like, it don't even feel like I'm older. Like, I still feel like my same normal self type shit. And I guess that's how I'm supposed to feel or not. I don't know, but, like... I don't know. I just kind of feel normal. Like, I just feel like myself. I just feel like I got a bunch more responsibility, like, on my plate and shit like that. But other than that, like, ain't really nothing changed, like, with me being 21. I can get me a little drink, you know what I'm saying? I can get me a little casa, you know what I'm saying? A little henny, a little hen dog. After this, I'm going to probably head to either Target or somewhere like that just to get my girl some flowers. And, um, a flowers in a car, you know what I'm saying? Show her some appreciation because we going out to dinner uh, later and shit like that. I'm going to probably vlog that. But yeah, yo, I'm going to be right back. Right back. Yeah, I'm going to be right back. Right back. You, might, you about to give me short rope. Give right me. Right. One, 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 two, three, four. Eat all, all of them. This freeze dry candy. This is my first time trying this. I'm going to do it like, what the fuck does it do? Bro, it's freeze dry. It tastes like a candy cheese puff. Yeah. yeah, that, that texture like, is a little yeah, weird, though, like, right? It's like it's stuck to the top of my mouth type shit. Pause. Pause. <laughs> Where can you get these ones from? Honestly, I was at my poppy. I was at the poppy store down my way, and I was so surprised whether they had them. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, you know what? Give me three of them. 
Damn. I grabbed him. And then some John was talking to me about him in the DMs, bro. The next thing you know, the next day, I found him. They're showing good as shit. Yeah. It tastes like uh the the, the like strawberry the marshmallows fruit is better. It tastes like the uh like the marshmallows and the um and the lucky charms, but they like a lot harder though. I fuck with these charms though. The girl started talking about you, like, oh my god, I'm like, I'm going right to the basement. He probably looked in the mirror like you. Smooth is like me. Him too. Damn. <laughs> bro, everybody, bro, trust me, bro. Yeah, trust when me, you bro. free, yeah, bro, you gotta start somewhere, yeah. like, you know what I'm saying? My one little cousin, he be coming in here, he be trying to act like he was with me. Yeah, start. Yeah. He said, you should be acting like he with me from the start. No, like, yeah, bro, I'm like, bro, you didn't get a haircut by me when I was 15, <laughs> 16 type shit. You know what I mean? So it was just like. We all got that phase, though. Yeah, yeah. We all got that phase. Yeah. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have a phase like that. Well, Just don't, don't let it consume think, me. Type I don't shit. think so. Huh? I don't think you are. I mean, You're like, because I ain't get the no money yet. You feel me? And I ain't never had nothing. Yeah, I was recording my cut. The whole time you started recording? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I was recording like five minutes ago. Well, we gotta get a mic and put it right here. The niggas not gonna hear that Bro, shit. Bro, no, no, low key. No, my mic really good. So they'll be able to hear that yeah? shit. Yeah? Yeah, they'll be able to hear that shit. Like when the so video yeah. come out. So I'm telling bro, he talking about some I ain't touching no money yet. I'm like, bro, when you got money, your, ex your taste is too expensive. He trying to call me a bad bitch, yo. That's that's, that's what he trying to say. He trying to call me a bad bitch. <laughs> Little uh, halftime check, yeah. I'm leaning back in the chair and shit. You feel me? I don't know if y'all can see me in the mirror, but I'm leaning back in the chair. Sure. Alright y'all, so I just got my cut I'm walking out the shop It's brick, it's like, it's fucking cold as shit Like, I'm walking back to my car But yeah y'all Got the cut, you feel me I don't know if y'all can see the full drum But y'all should be able to see it But I'm about to hop in my car Oh shit, my glasses back in there I forgot my glasses I'm gonna lie, I just pulled up the Target And I seen somebody with an OTF sticker on a windshield That is... Supreme dick suck. I'm not going to lie. You trying to call me a bad bitch? All right, y'all. I just grabbed some flowers for her. I asked two girls at the uh, at the joint because they was getting flowers too. I asked them which one should I choose out of the uh, the two options that I had. Because every time I come to this Target and I grab flowers, there's really not that many options. But these are pretty nice. I like these. I like these so much. But yeah, y'all. Um, I'm gonna probably get a card or something like that to go with the flowers. Or maybe I'll just get her something that she like. I don't know, but um. I'm about to go over to the car section because that shit is all the way over there. So I'm gonna let y'all know when I um when I get over there. You can see I got hold on let me actually put this these flowers down. If they're gonna stay. Are they gonna stay? You should be able to stay. But yeah, I got this card for her, y'all. You know what I'm saying? Just to show her some appreciation. You feel me? Nice little John. But yeah, y'all. We're about to go pay for this joint at the front. And then I'm gonna head home. But yeah, uh, I'm gonna probably try to go to self checkout way. But every time I come here, self checkout is crowded. So, but it's not today. So, as y'all can see, well, y'all probably can't see because it's big ass head. But yeah, y'all, um, we're going to the front. And I'm gonna probably just see y'all when I get back in the car. Because, you know what I'm saying? Because. Everybody want to look at me now since I'm recording and shit. I just wanted to pick the camera up just to update y'all. Uh, I just got my cut and shit like that. I just cut, I just I just took a couple of pictures. What the fuck, bro? What the fuck? I just took a couple pictures like in a ring light. I think I look a little good, y'all. I can't see myself. But I know I look good. I just got cut. But yeah, next time I'm pick up the camera, it's probably when we at, um, because like I said, me and my girl going out to eat. You know what I'm saying? Y'all just saw me um, come from Target, uh, getting the flowers in the car. Even though it's not Valentine's Day, uh, you should always show your girl love. Whoever it is in your life, your mom, your girl, you know what I'm saying? Always show the females in your life love. I'm going to pick up the camera once we get the chilies. That's where we're going to eat. I'm going to show y'all my food. And when I get her, and yeah, the reaction when she get her flowers. And yeah, we out this bitch. She trying to make me get a pedicure. Bro, I'm not getting no pedicure. Stop trying to make me get a pedicure, bro. How you doing? Uh, yeah, just a manicure. Yes, sir. 
I'll be right back. I'm gonna see if I can record. Bro, all right, so I'm here at the uh, nail salon and shit like that uh, to get my nails clean, bro. It's not gay to get your nails clean, yo. Like, I highly recommend. This is why you ugly niggas don't get bitches. It's because you don't take care of yourself, gang. Like, see? This shit need to be clean. I'll be biting my nails. Like, look at this. And I'm being so transparent with y'all. I'll be biting my nails and shit. But, yeah, y'all. We're here to get our nails done. We're not done. Like, clean. But, I'm gonna see if I can record. I'm gonna be right back to y'all. Yeah. <laughs> Is it okay if I record as well? I'm a vlogger, like I do YouTube. It's okay. Record the uh the finished product for y'all. You know what I'm saying? I don't think she said that uh she don't think that she put gel on my nails, but do it look like it? If y'all can see it. I think it looked like it. This joint was like bleeding a little bit though, like bro. I need to stop biting my fucking nails. Like seriously. Bro. I see that black spot? That's from this phone right here. This phone right here, bro. Every time I put it in my pocket, it make this black spot. What you getting? Frenchies. Frenchie, Frenchie. Why is my shit on flash, bro? Oh my gosh, bro. This bitch cool so fucking fast. I ain't gonna lie. I had to record this, bro. Bro, this shit... Bro, I'm at, so y'all know I'm at Chili's with my girl. Let me put this down. Y'all know I'm at Chili's with my girl, right? Bro, I'm so nervous right now. Like, we've been together for like a year. Look, well, we, we have been together for a year, but bro, it's just like, I'm still getting nervous. Like, you know, just sitting next to her because she's so beautiful. Like, hey, when you watch this video, like, I really want you to know, like, you're really bad at shit. Bro, if y'all can't tell, this is my first time getting alcohol at a restaurant. <laughs> Pretty good. Yes, yeah, Sirski. I got the full look. Huh? I got the full look. I got my full look. Point it this down real quick. Oh shit. Yeah, that's on sizzling. Ew. I should have got the fajitas. I ain't gonna lie. So many times. It is. Yeah. All right, y'all. We bury right back. Damn, bro. It's like that. Yo, you was a nut ass nigga, bro. Real shit. You trying to call me a bad bitch? I'm about to head down Temple. Um, we about to make some content with Legacy. That first clip y'all seen, it's just a reminder to y'all that um, Legacy is a nut. I call him twice, he ain't answer. But as soon as I turn the camera off, now niggas want to answer my call. That's crazy. We about to be on the way down to Temple. Um, I just got dressed. Uh, well, y'all really can't see my shoes, but I got some Asics on and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Some jeans, regular hoodie, but... Yeah, like, I'm not even going to get y'all a fit check because who the fuck is that? But, uh, what the fuck? See, I don't like when cars... See, now I got to pull out this spot because niggas is paranoid. Niggas, 5% tense, all black car. Come on, bro. I don't got no pole. No way to protect myself. I'm not even bearing no arms, gang. This shit is crazy. Yo, I literally just found somebody parking. So, look at this shit. What's good, Josh? I'm at Raising Cans right now. 
I haven't been here since I went to LA, so I don't even know what I'm gonna get, but um, I'm gonna just get all my order and shit when I order my food and all that. I just got here, bro. All I have is a fucking hoodie on. Bro, it's cold as fuck outside. It's like 30 degrees. So yeah, I'm gonna probably stay in here as long as possible, but yeah, after I get my order, just eat that bitch up. All right, so as y'all can see, I got me some canes, you feel what I'm saying? I, like I said, I haven't had this since uh, I went to LA and shit, so. I'm gonna try it for y'all, and I'm gonna let y'all know how it tastes for the people that haven't been here. I need some fucking ketchup. I don't got no ketchup for my fries, but I'll be right back here. I'm not gonna lie. That shit was fucking mid. Quick little story time and one video real quick. This is a little story time. So I came down here to do some content with Legacy, right? Waiting for this nigga to come outside, right? Bro, first I leave. I left first, right? I left first. This him calling me. This him calling me. No, I got I got to do this story time real quick. I left first. This nigga fried me. That, that's strike one. That's strike one. Then I came back. I called this nigga at 625 and told this nigga to come to the gate. This nigga has me wait outside for 13 minutes. And blistering cold like it ain't like bro i have no fucking coat on so that strike how the fuck you fry me twice in one night game like that shit is crazy and he want to come outside like he thorough or something i can't even really show y'all this nigga because the gate in the way but bro like frying me twice in one night is crazy next clip bro all right y'all so i was just sitting in the car with legacy and shit like that we didn't really get to make really no content because uh, something happened with like the building they, that they was in or whatever. But yeah, y'all, uh, as y'all can see, we are still down Temple. Uh, I just came from Kane's. I had to go to the bathroom real quick. But yeah, we was just sitting in the car, just talking about business, talking about like just other shit. But yeah, y'all, I don't know if y'all can hear me because it is one, but I'm about to get in the car. I'm about to be on my way home. And yeah, y'all, uh, I might be streaming for y'all tonight. This video gonna come out like weeks after this shit happened, so. Yeah, y'all, I might stream for y'all tonight. I might not. Uh, but yeah, y'all. About to be on the way home. Next clip. What's good, y'all? Today is currently Thursday. It is the 29th of February. And I think tomorrow's March 1st. So I don't know when this video is going to go up. It's probably going to go up in a couple weeks. But uh, happy first of the month. You feel what I'm saying? I hope you have a blessed and bountiful month. Uh, today, we are going to Morgan. Uh, this is not the start of a new vlog, so I'm about to give you a fit check. So I put my hoodie on because I had to go outside and say hi to Hershey, y'all. Uh. No? You're not fucking with it? All right. Uh, this is the fit for today. Um, we have the Jordan 5 with this on. Uh, as y'all can see, um, both of them are two different colors. Um, my super wide sweatpants. I really like these because, like, it's good for, like versatility type shit so i'm wearing these johns um matter of fact let me take my hoodie off for y'all real quick yeah y'all that's the fit paradise shirt on this i think no this is released but this is like an old release uh shout out to the real paradise you feel what i'm saying but yeah got the paradise shirt on a uh, pink balaclava you know i always gotta keep the balaclava on y'all know i miss the balaclava super wide pants the great pants you feel what i'm saying I ain't gonna lie, like, you ever look in a mirror and just, like, just, like, admire yourself, like, not to be, like, oh, I'm all that, but, like, you feel me, like, just, like, you feel me, you look good, you feel good, you dress good, you play good, you feel me. I don't know why my face was on that last clip, but I'm about to get me some spaghetti out of the refrigerator real quick, you know what I'm saying, this spaghetti is, like, Always a good food to eat, like, because there's always going to be plenty of it. Oh, I ain't going to lie, I'm going to put y'all on something if y'all don't know already. So listen, get, oh shit, let me turn this around. Turkey Hill Lemonade. As y'all can see, we just bought this shit yesterday, and it's almost gone. But yeah, Turkey Hill Mango Lemonade. I'm putting y'all on, you know what I'm saying? Oh yeah, also uh, Turkey Hill Iced Tea. Turkey Hill Iced Tea is good, but... I kind of like brisk better. I'm not gonna lie. Bro, every time I try to close this shit, this shit never shut, bro. But yeah, um, I'm about to make me a plate of spaghetti. Uh, George about to be on his way. And if I didn't tell y'all, uh, we're going to Morgan today. We're going there for a networking event. Uh, shout out George for making this possible. And yeah, so about to go there and make some connections. You feel what I'm saying? It's a two hour drive. So, and you feel me? Hopefully, this is an hour. Uh, I'm going to make this video as long as possible 
And this is probably going to be the first hour long video. If y'all fucking with me, hit that like button. If y'all made it to this point in the video, make sure y'all hit that motherfucking like button, bro. Because if you don't, niggas, niggas can't eat. Bro, from this perspective, bro, like, I got to hit the legacy stance. From this perspective, though, bro, like, my fit be looking like fire. We need to get some more waters. I got to run to the market. Um, Probably, uh, I'll probably run to the market tomorrow to get some waters. Let me put my, my hoodie. Because like, this shit is, like, all crumbled up and shit, like. Because this shit in my pocket, but yeah. Um, I'm about to make myself a plate of spaghetti. And yeah, I'm going to hit Chuck up probably when George get here. Hopefully he can take us to Wawa. I ain't going to lie. I got to grab a bed for the road. And uh, yeah, we'll be right back. Yeah, so I don't know if I have any smokers on my channel. But if I do, if I have any smokers that are on my channel, um, make sure that y'all are detoxing your lungs. Um, it is very important to detox your lungs. You feel what I'm saying? Because all of that... We're not supposed to be inhaling the smoke like that. So, but if you do smoke, please get you some kombucha tea, some herbal tea, some malayan leaf tea. I was looking in here and I couldn't really find where it was at. All I could find was fucking ramen noodles and I don't know what the fuck this is. But yeah, make sure that y'all are clearing your lungs out. You feel what I'm saying? My mom be buying this stuff. Yeah, so detox, healthy cleansing formula. So yeah, caffeine free. It's organic. Make sure y'all clean y'all lungs out, all right? This is not a promotion of tobacco products. This is not for you kids to start smoking. I do not recommend that y'all start smoking. But if y'all are, like I said, please go grab you some herbal fucking tea, all right? We out this bitch. Oh, my phone is ringing. This ugly ass nigga. Yo. You all set? Yeah, come on up. All right. Y'all, should I get these? I know I got these the last time y'all seen me, but should I get these? Hopefully, you give me a bed, because none of these up here, like, nothing up here is, like, really appealing. And I don't really, like, eat candy and shit, like, I don't know. I've just always been afraid of, like, uh, i always been afraid of, what's the fucking word for it? Cavities. i always been afraid. Like, this shit, like... I know niggas that eat this shit. Like, these actually good though. I ain't gonna lie. These actually all right, but I'm gonna put these back for now. Cause like I said, niggas always been afraid of cavities. So I'm gonna put that back. But yeah, um, I ain't gonna lie. Or some Doritos. I could get some Doritos, but I think I'm gonna just stick with these. And then like, probably like something to drink or something. Let me see. Let me get something good. They got body armor. I'm not drinking fucking prom. Uh, I think we gonna grab a snap. Uh, which one? Kiwi, strawberry, or raspberry tea? Or I can get a Mystic. Is this the coconut one? Yes, it is. I'm gonna get this, John. Grab this one. Let's see if they give me a bag. Let me see if they give me a bag. Yes. No, no, no. Um, cash and first. Sturdy Eats. W Eats in the comments. You feel what I'm saying? W Fit in the comments. This shit's oh, tough. Three, four. Yeah, I'm going to be right back, y'all. Not take too long. No, Type shit. I'm about to show you what I got, though. Hold on. Nice look. Sunfire Seeds W. W for the Sunfire Seeds. Yeah. Type shit. And then I got it. You ever had a uh, Mystic? Is those the regular yeah, the regular uh, original joints. Oh. You like the Mystic joints? No, I never had it. Yeah, bro, you gotta try this coconut, bro. For everybody that's watching right now, bro, please try this. Uh, bro, my girl put me on this shit. It's a uh, Mystic Lada Colada. Next time y'all go to the store, yeah, bro, you gotta try this shit, bro. Next time y'all go to the store, bro, please grab this shit, bro. I'm telling y'all right now, bro, probably the best drink you ever had. Hey, <laughs> What's good, y'all? So as y'all can see, we are at Morgan State. Bro, I ain't gonna lie. Last time I seen niggas playing lacrosse was when I watched Team Wolf. I ain't gonna lie. But yeah, we are at Morgan State. Just uh, parked in the garage and shit like that. So we're on our way to the event. Um, took us like, what, two hours to get up here? But yeah. In a minute here, I'm about to introduce my guest, Chris Simon. He is a Morgan State alum. 
uh, owner of Black Swan on some real estate. I want y'all to show him some love, and we about to get this thing on the road. Y'all ready? Let's go. I want you to first give yourselves a round of applause for showing up to something like this. When I was here, I wouldn't have come to this. <laughs> but um, I'm kidding. But it means that you're invested in yourself already, right? You guys are, uh, by show of hands, business students? Social work department, engineering, what? Engineering, okay. But majority business students? Come on now, I need some energy back from y'all. I'm gonna give y'all the same energy yeah. back from me. First of all, shout out to all of the student vendors here, man. That is very, this is very big. Can we give them a round of applause now? Yeah. You guys have started an entrepreneurship journey at a young age, and that is no small feat. You know, like you guys, are taking that risk to uh, fill a void, but then also taking that risk to you know follow your passion. And especially where I'm from, Baltimore, that is something that doesn't happen often, right? A lot of people want to tell you no, that you can't do this, um, and you guys are persevering through that doubt, the self-doubt, the, the other people's doubt, and stuff like that. So again, that's that's it's it's very big that you guys are starting at this age. I'm very inspired. Um, so just a little bit about myself. Uh, I'm from Baltimore, Maryland. Um, there's me. Um, Nike, can we keep going? Thanks, uh, please. Just a lot of other people. Um, and so we're here today to talk about business. So I want to just tell you a little bit about myself before we actually get into uh, the real conversation. So I am the, um, I'm from East Baltimore, the home of the wire, home of Drew Hill, home of Carmelo, all that other stuff. Um, I come from an entrepreneurship household. My parents, uh, my dad opened Westside Carryout. My mother was a framer, so my basement was my mother's framing studio. So I didn't have a big sofa and a large screen TV down there. We had exacto boards and, and Mac boards and black art. Um, but that really taught me a lot. It really taught me that entrepreneurship spirit at a young age. And I got into entrepreneur by sitting in church. Anybody goes to church? All right, and I used to be bored in church. And so we, and we used to go to the first service, then the second service, and then sometimes the third service. And so I'd be bored, so I was just started drawing. And when I started drawing, um, my mother was a framer. So I would draw people in church and then sell it to them. And then my mother decided that she was gonna frame some of my artwork and take it to um, uh, one of those seasonal bazaars or whatever and sold some of my artwork. She only sold it to my aunts though, but it was my start and my entrepreneurship journey. And then from there, I started out, I opened a clothing store. So my, I left Baltimore, went to the University of Maryland Eastern Shore. I had started a clothing store called Sino when I was in uh, 12th grade. And then I went to the University of Maryland Eastern Shore. I would drive home on the weekends, meet manufacturers, I would, you know, ride around uh, selling our clothes, and then I'd go back to school when I was selling there. And state, pro this is when state property first came out, and Beanie Siegel and everybody, they came to Eastern Shore, we had a fashion show, and then I applied for a small business uh, loan, um, and I got $10,000. And at the time, that just seemed like a tremendous amount of money. And I invested $900 of that, and I bought me a, uh, a minivan from the police repossession auction, and then I invested the other 9,100 all in merchandise. I just emptied the whole, I just bought everything, just put it all into this one order. And uh, I used to ride through every dope strip, every hood, every county, selling my clothes out the trunk of this minivan. And from there, I graduated to being able to open a clothing store. Um, uh, and my first clothing store was on Fulton and Riggs. It was inside of a Bell's Bar. And I'm telling you this because, you know, people you, people see you now, right? And they're like, oh, this guy does great, but they don't know your humble beginnings. I used to live in the back of that store. I used to live in the back of the store. It was one room and it was a half bathroom. And my first got up, to, when I first came to Morgan, I was living in the back of that store, that one room. And then from there, I was wound up open. I just was just humble, right? And I wound up opening two more stores from there. Uh, and then from that, I won the 2008 Small Business Entrepreneur of the Year uh, in 2008. Um, uh, but while I was working there, I wound up having a passion, developing a passion for mental health, right? I started working at a group home overnight. So I would go to school, I would work at a group home overnight, I would work 
for some other mentoring agencies, um, and I would run Sino. Uh, so I was doing all of that while I was in school, just you know, just sacrificing to try to uh, accomplish my dreams. Which is a manufacturer of plant-based products. We were on Shark Tank season 12, episode 15. Uh, Mark Cuban, I think, came to get uh, that deal. It is currently right now, it's the highest rated episode in uh, Shark Tank history. Our products are currently being sold in over 6,000 grocery doors nationwide. Uh, I am an equity partner with Live Nation, which means I am the official plant-based partner for all the Live Nation festival, concerts, and House of Blues. Um, General Mills is my equity partner, um, and we partner with Sedexo Magic as well, where though our products are inside of uh, several different universities. We're also going into uh, DC public school system starting in the fall, as well as how as, as well as how hospital. And I'm a graduate of Morgan State University, and shout out to the news, I'll fly you in no time. I have the same story because, you know, my first business was Movie Solution, which was at Morgan State University when I had the, the, the like, DVD vending machines downstairs. And then that business, you know, didn't go well. So there's so much failure up until what you see with life really, really happens. I always knew that I wanted to go into entrepreneurship. One of the biggest things was I, you know, I'm from Prince George's County, Maryland, so federal government, everything. So I was interning for HUD, you know what I'm saying, back, you know what I'm saying, from high school pretty much through college, and then I got a job with the FDIC. I was an intern. And I never did when I graduated, they didn't convert me to full time. So to me, that was the biggest sign in the actual world. Like, yo, I interned for you guys for two and a half years, and then you didn't, didn't give me this full time job. Um, and, and then still, you know, movie solution, I had wrote this like proposal to put it inside of the like DC Metro system, and I had won the whole contract. I had beat out Redbox at the time, and I had, and I, and I, and I beat out Blockbuster. But I didn't have the financing for it, so I had to There's so many dark days and months and years before you see anything like, you know, I'll just leave one, you know, there's a, there's a quote that I was taught when I was online, right? Caesar's motto, a couple months of sacrifice for a lifetime of paradise. And if you live in that, then you'll understand it. And those months, those months can be 12, 24, 48, you know what I'm saying? 96, 120. You just have to keep going to get to the, you know what I'm saying, get to the paradise. The problem is, you know what I'm saying, most people give up when they don't get what they want. Bridges, because you never know when you have to tap into someone. Tricks was somebody that I, I went to his parties when I was here. He would give me some tough time at the door initially, but then he's, you know, he started putting me down on his VIP list, putting me down on his VIP list. Now I have events at the restaurant, and I'm putting him down on my VIP list and everything like that, right? So you, it's it's full circle. You never know where you're going to be and how you're going to connect with someone. Tricks for you. Talk about, talk to them about how you started off in the party industry and how you've taken that to create these different verticals. Like you, you, you're still doing what you're very passionate about, how you've taken that passion and turned it into a business. When I uh, came to Morgan, I was the friendly person. Of course, I was very friendly with the ladies, but I had a lot of, like I had the football team was cool with me, the basketball team was cool with me, so I was, it was easy when we did events and we had to fill up the bus and stuff like that. It's a mess, it's terrible, it's this, it's that. And so my husband just says to the project manager, we were up for the job, we're bidding against other people, he's like, why don't we do it on the weekends? And an entire university of geniuses were like, what? And so we became their go-to people because we come in on Friday night and by Monday we have done new carpets, new tiles, new floors, new ceilings, and put their shit back. That, and so that became something that, no, for, for whatever reason, no one had thought of. And so now we're their go-to person for their fit-outs for all their offices because it was just a niche that nobody had thought of. So continue to be creative and think about things and interrogate it the way nobody else can do but you. And we were talking about this in the back that they might not access the capital, but they can't do what I do. Right? So you are enough. I want you to be, not be ignorant and think that you can just continue to be who you are and that's enough. You have to continue to be evolving. You have to continue to grow. You have to continue to educate yourself and prepare yourself for the opportunity. Because opportunity is going to come, but if you're not prepared, then it's not going to, you know, you're not going to be able to seize that moment. I really like it. I wouldn't trust that nigga neither. Yeah. Oh, we got to start the vlog right, man. I ain't show y'all this mess though. You feel me? I look like a. Like, look at this, bro. 
This shit look hard, bro. This is what I like about the clothing mitts. They don't match with my pants, though. But I feel like this is a good fit. Like, the red coordinates with, like, all of the colors in my shirt. The yellow go with the colors in my shirt. You feel me? But don't mind them watch clothes up there type shit. They, you know, women in the house. What's good, YouTube? This is the same vlog. But, um, yeah, if y'all like the, uh... If y'all like the Morgan State content, make sure y'all like the video, like this video. Actually, uh, hopefully this is my first hour vlog. Um, but like I was telling y'all, I got a new balaclava mess. I kind of probably look weird though. I'm not gonna lie, I probably look weird. Like, hold on. Whoop. Today, um, we're going to thrift shopping. Today we're going to thrift shopping. I don't know if this is actually going to be a new video, but if it is a new video, welcome, welcome, fucking welcome, nigga. Fucking welcome, nigga. Welcome to the Films family, bro. Welcome to the Films family. But yeah, y'all, today we are going thrifting. Um, I'm currently waiting for Legacy to pick me up. Hold on, let me take this off real quick. I'm currently waiting for Legacy to come pick me up right now. But yeah, y'all, um, I just wanted to start off the vlog just to show y'all that I got my new clava. Just to show y'all my fit. Y'all know I always start my vlogs off in the bathroom, you feel what I'm saying? But yeah, y'all, it's going to be a great day today. I ain't going to lie, I look a little good, you feel me? Even without a cut, but you can't, you don't even know. You don't even know. Going thrifted today, um, probably going to take some clothes and stuff down there. Um, see if I can exchange anything and stuff like that. But yeah, um, yeah, probably make some money today. Um, go shop and see what I can grab in the store and stuff like that. And then, yeah, I'm gonna probably get a um, like a fit video for y'all, but I'm gonna let y'all know. But yeah, y'all, we hold this bitch. Hey, bro, you got space in your car? Yeah. All right, all right, bet. I'm about to bring this bag. Hold up, I'm about to uh, flip the screen type shit. All right, but I'm just, I'm just, I'm just saying, bro. Like, I just wanted you to be prepared so that when I come out with the bag, it's not low, like, oh, that it don't fit. All right. Out of me. What's the point? Huh? <laughs> what you gonna eat today? Huh? What you gonna eat today? I don't know. You just said you're going out to eat. <clears throat> oh, oh, when I was scrolling through Instagram, oh, me and my friends both together. You gonna give me something from there? Huh? You wanna give me something from there? Yeah, sure. Hey, what you what you getting? I don't know. I, I don't know. Let's see when I get there. I don't even know what they got. Alright, you gotta call when you get there or text me. <laughs> Will do. Alright. Hey, Why are you recording this? Okay. This is not for the net. It's not for the socials. What if, what if, what if I was cheating on my girl right then and there? You don't got a girl. And now, and now she got it all. You don't got a girl. I don't. But I got somebody that I love dearly. All right, so I know y'all sub to me, but I know y'all sub to him as well. Y'all know he does not have a girl, bro. Say goodbye. <laughs> she was up to the vlog, Brittany. Oh, what's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? No, dude. Welcome back to the channel. You feel me? Hey, yo, you know what I'm saying? What's up, baby? You know what I'm saying? But yeah, yo. We downtown. We about to uh, go to the thrift store down there. I forget what that shit called. Oh, no. Matter of fact, it's called Buffalo Exchange. So I'm going to walk in there first and see if I can actually. This nigga in the back of my vlog. What you doing, gang? All right. I'm going to ask him if I can uh, exchange some clothes. This nigga still in the back of my vlog. He's still in the back of my shit. He's still in the back. Why ain't you saying nothing, nigga? Yeah, where you get this jacket from? I don't even want to wear it. I don't like yeah, it. Yeah, that's a biker jacket. Yeah. Type shit. But yeah, yo, as I said for the third time, about to walk in Buffalo Exchange. I see you, bro. I, I see you already. I see, I see you. I see, I see it. I see, I see it. it. No, what you do? I did, what you do? Yo. All right, though. So we about to go in Buffalo Exchange. I'm going to see if we can, uh, <laughs> I'm going to see if we can, uh, exchange these clothes and shit like that, but. I gotta walk in and actually ask because this is a big ass bag and it's in a. Oh, I can't show his license plate right here. How much was it? Six pounds? Oh, well, you feel like that? Yeah. Great. Perfect. Perfect. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, yo, we about to walk in this zone. I'm not trying to leave here. Alright, so we are in here, y'all. So, alright. So, the target for today, I'm gonna grab at least like two pairs of pants. 
and like no not two pairs of pants like at least two shirts and like two pairs of pants and then probably like an accessory if i can grab one bro it's a lot of people in here bro there's so many fucking people in here bro this shit is crazy oh, i gotta take a thumbnail outside monkey man look at y'all back there he was following us, bro. Little quick fit check in the mirror. This shit hard. Read my, uh, read my fit screen one at a time. Uh, com. Seven. Why not at least like eight? <laughs> why not a, why not like an eight? I don't know. I fold the boohoo pants, but then I do at the same time. And then it's all colorful. Is it, is it the, is it the, like, the sizing of it? Yeah, kind of. It's the yeah. sizing type shit. It'd be, it'd be better if you like, had like a top or something. Like a, 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 on some like an oversized type? On some ghillie suit type. Uh, like a matching joint. No. I already that got, that's why I got this joint to match. But this joint don't even match. It just, it's camouflage. So it just look like it type shit. But I'm trying to find a, uh, a shirt. Like, what the fuck is this? Let's look at some prices real quick. $14. That's not too bad. But we in the, we in the women's section. No, I'm drawing a little bit. Oh, what's this? No, I'm talking about like the stuff over there type yeah, shit. Yeah, you got it. I don't know. I'm, yeah, I might be cool. Ew. This might not be my thing, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I think the, the key to Griffin is just that you just have to find something that's like kind of like unorthodox and then just try to make it work with an outfit type shit. So like something like this could probably work with... Like a, this is like a rainy day outfit type shit. Like you wouldn't really wear this on like a regular day. I mean, I'm just saying, like you would, if you was to wear this, it'd probably be on a rainy day, type, like a rainy day fit type shit. And some sneakers you could probably sacrifice. No, you don't feel me. All right. <laughs> I'm trying to. Ask, all right. So these are jackets. I'm not really looking for jackets, y'all. I'm really looking for like, shirts and stuff. And the shirts are down here. And I need smalls. This is an extra large. They don't have no sizes on here. They don't got no sizes on here. Like it's just you just gotta look through them bitches. Let me know in the comments if y'all seeing something I could probably grab. Like, I'm seeing a bunch of different fabrics, but... And this is why I got to learn how to make my own clothes, bro. Because I could probably take, like, some of these different fabrics and make it into clothes or something like that. Like, oh, shit. I'm really trying to do that shit, though. Yeah, I don't know. This shirt look nice, but, like, it's not really something I wear. And it's big as shit. It's not extra large, gang. Okay, so these these just look like these just look like um like plaid shirts or not plaid uh fucking I forget what these ones called I forget what these ones called but like these look like church shirts a little bit yeah like yeah dress shirts that's what they call dress shirts damn like what is there to let me go look in the This look like a uniform. This is a uniform. What the fuck going on? But who turned in a uniform? Okay. This is nice. This is nice. But this is a medium. I could probably wear this, but wait, what? I don't know, y'all. Options looking a little. Oh shit. Options looking a little small. Yeah, nah. Yeah, nah. Like, come on, what the fuck? Like, what are these? Yo. They leather? Yeah, bro. Oh, shit, what the fuck? What? You see them? He's gotta be fake. They fake. What? These. Those? Yeah, it's gotta be fake. Cause they leather? There's no way. It's a festival, on them. Bro, I don't think them bitches real, bro. I'm not going to lie. These 30, though. These 30. You know, some rain No, not even that. You could probably wear it with, like, some calm shit to not even show, like, the front. Yeah, I agree. You feel me? Yeah. You could make that into a fit, just clean the sides off. 
Like, you know what I'm saying? Calm shit. You probably can't wear that with shorts, though. <laughs> Come on, bro. Yo. What's the fit with this, bro? <laughs> right. What the bottom look like? What's the fit? Oh, yeah, nah. He stepped in it shit too. Like <laughs> bro, they really don't. They don't really got no, like, interest in like yeah. nothing that catch my eye. Except for that, everything I see over there, I be thinking it's bait. Over there? Excuse me. Excuse me. All right, so we in a tease right now, y'all. Try to find some tea. All right, so over here is probably where I'm going to find most of my shit. Yeah, your tease. Because the tease, the tease be, you could be, I feel like if anything, out of any piece of your outfit, you could probably be more versatile with tease than anything. Tease or shoes. Yeah, but like, I think it just depends on what you're going for, though. Yeah. Is this a small? This is a medium. I think this thirty. This thirty. This is a little thin, but it's cool, yeah. It is a little thin. I don't know. It's cool, like. Yeah, it's cool. I might grab it. I'll be right back, y'all. All right, y'all. So I got two shirts. Um, I'm about to show y'all actually right now. I got an ACDC shirt, as y'all can see. Hold on. Good looking. I got an ACDC shirt. You know what I'm saying? Simple. Look, when y'all go, I'm sorry to use you as, but when y'all go thrifting, please look at the quality of the shirts and shit like that. I know this is my first time, but like, I'm just telling y'all based off my experience, like just. Make sure that you really paying attention to the quality. Like, really okay. All right, look, y'all. The camera cut out, but bro, drop W Legacy in the comments. I know the camera look way clearer, bro. You do that shit every time, bro. There, What's you this do that shit every time, bro. Every, look, and I got a fucking lens cap, and that shit still like you feel. Me? But look, I got a shirt. But look, before the camera cut off, I was saying to pay attention to the quality and stuff, like in the in the shirts and stuff. When you come to thrift stores, you want to make sure they're not dirty, they're not too wrinkled, and they're not too thin. Because if you wash them, you feel me? They might fuck up. But yeah, y'all. Got two shirts. And now we look at some pants. Let's look at some pants. I really want some shorts. Like some, uh... Like those, y'all? Yeah. Men's 36 is crazy, though. What you wear? I wear size 30. Damn, that's what I'm saying. Like, they don't got no... Like, see, I'm not, I'm not wearing this. <laughs> I'm fucking like gonna wear this in the shower, my nigga. <laughs> come on, bro. <laughs> that dude look like some shower shit. Like, come on, bro. Look like shower shorts, man. But I really, I really want to look for some, like, some jean shorts because Asics look really good with jean shorts. I put y'all on real game. If you got a pair of good Asics, if you got a pair of Asics, get you some jerks. All right, let's find some pants. What? Then you gonna cut them, Jones? I mean, I could, but... You know, you know what looking for? I could. I could. I really do got step... Look, y'all. I ain't tell y'all, but I really want to step into my bag of, like, being a, a, a fashion, like, creator type shit. So, if I find any of these pants over here, and I fuck with them, like, and they my size, I don't know. I might try to turn them into shirts, and that'll be my first... I'm gonna make a video on it. Drop a comment if y'all want me to uh, make a video on me, like, customizing my own clothing and shit like that. Size 30. All I see is 32s. I mean, I could wear a 32 in life. Oh, uh, yeah, no. Somebody got shot in the middle. Like, everybody getting shot, bro. What the fuck going on? Nigga got hit with a hollow in his ass, bro. Shit crazy. I do need, like, some regular... Like, I do need a regular pair of denim. Like, a regular... A regular fit jean pair of denim type shit. Is this men's? Yeah, this is men's. Oh, that's too much knee. Like, what the fuck? I might got shot in the middle. That's way too much knee. My knee's ashy as shit already. Oh, they do have the sizes on it. Mm. Okay, so those are, those are 30. I can wear 30. 30 and 32. Quarter row. I kind of do fuck with corduroy pants, but they look grayed out though. Like, don't they look, they look colorless, like, I don't know. I think that might be the color. I mean, it might be, but 
if these was to fit like right to the T of my ankle, I wouldn't like that shit though. Yeah, you want them a little high with her? Like, I wanna, no, not even that. It all depends on what shoe I have on. Like, mm. I wouldn't wear that with no Asics though. That shit don't look right. Like, I'd probably wear that with something more formal type shit. Mm -hmm. So, like, Jordan 1s. Like, that's the perfect shoe I could think of. Yeah, none of these drums really. Yeah, bro. I think the shirt's gonna be the yeah. only thing that we cop today. Yeah, yeah. All right, so these are two pickups for the day. I'm about to go check out. Um, I'm about to go ask him if I can actually uh, exchange my clothes in. But other than that, we out this bitch. Nigga, still recording. Um, this is behind the scenes. Um, when you edit this shit. Just make sure you don't put this in the bed, all right? I might got shot in the bed. All right, y'all, so we got the bag of clothes in here. I'm just trying to sell these joints real quick. Just like all old clothes, like stuff from Sheen, stuff that I've been got, like, you feel me? Old shirts and stuff like that, so. About to sell this bag. Yeah, I'm gonna let you know when we finish. This shit was a fucking struggle trying to carry this shit, but. Bro, you carried it for two seconds. I carried it halfway down the street. You gonna kick my back? That's right. No, he locked his keys in the car before we got back here. So I'm keeping this in the video just so you remember this type shit. Mike got shot. In the <laughs> Do it again. Michael, Do it again. <laughs> <laughs> All right, bet. Now, um, when you go back to the crib, just look for all your shit. Nigga, you crooked. Like finally got the ox in the you wheel. You crooked. Bro. Ah. All right, hold on. Bro, the security guard in there. She ass, but that body. What, what it, that was a bullet. What security guard are you talking about? The security guard that was over there type shit. Oh, I forgot to get a thumbnail. Fuck. You better drive by it. Yeah, you I right. I do, but I don't really. I want a picture of me doing this in front of the store type shit, but. I'm gonna just get a picture of the, Yeah, I'm just get a picture of the store. You gotta drive slow though, bro. You don't drive slow as up. Alright. Uh, uh, London is great now. If I say your real name, my chin, niggas probably already know your real name, Isaac. Nobody knows my real name. Isaac, nigga, <laughs> Sir Isaac Newton. Fuck, it's 2024. Laughed, nigga, nigga, nigga named Isaac. Laughed, yes, you, yeah, yes, you did. Yes, you did, bro. 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 Yes, you did, bro
Think about it. Come on, bro. Think about it. You stay up too long. You're too tired to go to sleep. Why the army so small? Bro, you too. A lot of niggas. All right. If y'all understand where I'm coming from, you're too tired to go to sleep. Like, you try to go to sleep, but you can't. come and get off. It's as simple as you think about it, bro. Like, some people. No, that'd be. This would be a good picking spot. I feel as though this would be a good picking spot. Wait, what street is this? What street is this? It's called Cafe Oil. Oil. So, remember that. Put on the vlog. Cafe what? Cafe O. Oh, I just gave y'all my spot. <laughs> Yo, I just gave him the picture spot. It's cool, y'all can come here. In the um, in the FDR skate park. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That shit, yeah, that shit's a good type shit. Like you too comfortable to go to sleep. Yeah, type shit. Not too tired. I mean, some... if I'm ever too tired, I'm going right to sleep. I mean, you would think that you that tired. And you would actually go to sleep, but you wouldn't sleep for as long as you thought you would. Type shit. Mm-hmm. That's what I'm saying. No, but damn, they just stole my spot, bro. That's crazy. The skate park, uh, a good spot though. That shit's too overused. The one that we went to? Yeah, the one that, uh, for the branch route. Yeah, it's too overused, bro. That John. I don't like. Uh, I don't like uh, to take a picture at a spot and then a nigga can tell me where I'm at. Damn, Sam, probably the best spot to take but, pictures. But no location. Just, uh, just find a place where it's like some nice graffiti. You'll be alright. That's exactly what like you need. The, I like to imagine myself in my spots and drive around and find them. That's how Which I spots you mind. like to take pictures in? I like unique spots. Like, that's what I like. Like, no ideal gems? Like, like not on the top of your head, like, location exactly, but, like, what you want your location. Like this, I like, mean, not location. Like, like this like was like just me. I just drove and found this spot, like, to get my video in. Type shit. Like. The red door got a lot of character in the vid. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Yep. All right. Skateboarder. Let's see. Bro, I want to get a second called soap. First time getting the sides. This shit gonna be a breeze. Shit, that's stupid ass. Yo, man. I don't even know what I want. What should I get? What you uh, recommend type shit? Number two. Number two? Why are you leave this shit in the car? The two sliders with front. What you mean? Please take it. Leave what in the car? Leave what in the car? What should I get, yo? Uh, I think I'm gonna get like the two sliders. Hold on. Oh shit. Wait, do I have to order from here? Oh, this is DoorDash. Okay. Uh, two sliders with fries. Hold on, yeah. Hey, doing? Um, can I get? This is my first time here. Can I get the two sliders with fries? Please take the meal. Two zero seven. Please take the meal. Appreciate it. Got me a sandwich from my. I got the uh, number two, John. Yeah, you got cheese on your fries? No, I ain't get cheese. I should have got cheese, but I don't know if my girl like cheese fries. I don't think she like cheese fries, but yeah, y'all. I got me the number two. That's the two sliders with the fries and shit. So, uh, I'm gonna let y'all know after I finish this joint how it was. And yeah, I'm gonna be right back. I might got shot in the middle. All right, y'all, so I got the Asads. Got the, huh? You got mine? I think he got, yeah, he got yours, yeah. I got the Asads, y'all. So I'm gonna let y'all know how this joint tastes. Um, what the fuck? Ugh, fuck. But I'm gonna let y'all know how this shit tastes. Uh, probably when I get to the crib, but um, yeah, appreciate you for taking me to the side. Shut up, nigga. They ain't give me no honey. Oh, you can have my shit, bro. Oh, they give me one pet. What is going on, y'all? We just got back from uh, a side side chicken. If y'all seen the last clip, but um, I actually didn't eat it yet. So um, whenever I eat it, um, I do want to do a taste test for y'all. So I'm gonna probably just do it when I get back to the crib because I just got back from getting it and I just got back from thrift shopping. But um, I already showed y'all what I picked up. And I, um, I actually sold some clothes today, uh, but if y'all want to make some extra money, um, if there's any like thrift store, if, I said thrift stores, thrift stores that like buy or sell or trade clothes, make sure y'all go there. And um, it's two options that you could pick. It's either you can accept the money in cash or you can get store credit. I recommend the cheese, bro. Um, only got two pieces. I didn't really get any pants, um, but I did get two shirts. 
All right, y'all, this is my first time eating a size hot chicken. Uh, y'all want the proof? The bag is right here. You feel me? I already put the honey on the sandwich. I got the perfect setup. There you go. Got a picture of my bun. All right, then I put the, the ketchup on the fries and shit, and I still got the sauce in the tuck, so I'm not missing out on everything. So, yeah, first time eating the sides. Let's get to it. That shit was mad. I'm not gonna lie. All right, y'all. All right, y'all. So this is my first. I'm. A, this is my first uh, time I'm gonna try acai bowl. So yeah, uh, I don't know if I'm gonna get a taste test for y'all on the camera, but I'm gonna definitely tell y'all how it tastes. So yeah, and this is from Tropical Smoothie, by the way. And show him. So if y'all wanna come grab, y'all can come grab this bitch, bro. I'm gonna put this joint back in there. Uh, taking everything out. Of the no, I only only took it off the bag, so I just took mine out. Showing that shit. But yeah. Why don't you take them off the uh, the bag? I'm giving myself options. Let's go. I was just saying, <laughs> like you could have took it out the bag to get a better thumbnail. You could have took a, a picture of both of them, y'all. Yo, I ain't gonna lie, bro. Look how bad it's raining and snowing outside. What is going on? Like, bro, it's like some weird, like rain and sleet, snow. Look at it, yo. Look, it's sticking. Yo, what the fuck? Look how it's falling on the ground, though. That shit is not real. Yeah. Yo, it's sticking, yo. What you All right, I'll be right back, yo. Fuck. <laughs> bro, they can't see that, bro. <laughs> All right, I'm about to taste it for myself. Excuse my dusty dashboard, y'all. <laughs> In the car, though. <laughs> it's no way. And I caught it on camera. I guess we trying the strawberry and the coconut first, which is it's good. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> these strawberries look fresh, y'all. Look at these. Mm. Strawberries look dumb fresh. Yo, why the fuck? I just dropped all this coconut. Yes, I'm eating it off my pants. Suck my dick. At least it was just the uh, the coconut shavings. And before y'all ask me, y'all be in the comments like, Zero, why your hair ripped up? It's I did his uh, hair. Yeah, she did my hair. She um, she did individuals. I was going to get cornrows, but my hair not long enough. So she put it in the individuals and shit, so make my hair grow out but y'all it's good i can we can get it again Here's i would get it again especially the granola oh and then when you pull it off on the bike you can't just dump the clutch like you can't just open it up if you open it up the bike gonna come from under you so that's where you be like thinking like when you like when you do this and then that shit like no, you feel like, me look, Oh, like that? Okay, okay. Yeah, like so just because I just, generally, I just let it go, then the bike is not gonna, I mean, mm -hmm. it's not gonna go. And just always start your bike, you always wanna kind of start it in neutral because it's just the, the common center place. If I started in gear, it's at risk of like, that shit. Flying off here. So, click it back up in the first. That light should come on to show that it's in neutral. Now, when you wanna ride off, you give it a little, so when first put it in gear, give it a little gas. You see how slowly, like, watch the process slowly. Once I'm off of it, it pulled me out. Tight, sir. Understood. I know what he just said. Like, Tight, somebody got shot in the middle. This nigga just showed y'all how to work a bike. So if y'all got any bikes or if y'all planning on getting any bikes, you feel me? I heard it though. Huh? I heard it though. So how many, how many did I go? We don't know. Two? Yeah. Yeah, I heard that shit. So when you hear one, it's gonna go. And then once it gets to like a certain peak, you be like, oh, that's too much for You click it up, then you feel the less stress on the bike. Mm -hmm. 
like off of this, if I'm revving, come off, like you, this how niggas be doing power with Cause it, it being in first gear is amount, like that short amount of time like, of the gas getting into the engine, mm -hmm. like that. I wonder how niggas be like staying up there though. Like niggas like. Well, that comes to a little bit of balance. Yeah. And then also with like in the gears, it's like when you going down, that's why it's like so hard for me. That's my whole thing mm -hmm. about me going backwards. And then once I'm up here, it's like not going back there. Yeah. So with niggas holding it up, they'll, they'll pop it up to get the engine gas to keep it rolling up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's all, that's why I'm saying like, they'll, like cause some niggas, I don't know if they fucking bounce the bike. But like, if you stay in that one place type shit, cause some niggas just just stay there and just like, you feel me, oh, on some on some crazy shit. Especially with four wheelers, niggas be drunk. Niggas be drunk with four wheelers, bro. Wanna get on the back? <laughs> he reluctant, yo. He reluctant. Oh, <laughs> niggas said a sentence. Like, it's about where did the day? All that shit got cut in. <laughs> What, bro? Say and we asking the question of the day, so you better be ready too. What question? question of the day? Nah, don't know the question. Oh, the, uh, the yes, uh, bro. like a frequently asked uh, question. Take I ain't got no cut, so that's going. Oh to my god! I don't either. That's going to be our Friday. Friday. No, we're doing it today still. Uh, that's cool. I right. still look good. You look good. Damn, damn, bro, it's bumpy as shit. Damn, damn. You talking about the bit mobile handle? This shit, this shit can't. Nah, bro, we in the. Yeah, yeah, we're, it's we're, 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 it's, we're, it's, we're, it's we're, a street, bro. I don't be trying to drive down this bit just because of this. Right? Man, it's, it's, oh, we so are in North, right? We in North. We in North. This is that pretzel. Oh yeah, I just be. This is that pretzel on what I tell you about that. I'm gonna keep it being the cheese pretzel to be exact. Nah, you drive. I want some some sweet cream cheese pretzels. Whoa. That's a place. Ooh, sweet cream cheese. Yeah, sweet cream cheese, bro. Sweet cream cheese is good as fuck, bro. I ain't gonna lie. You ever had some joints from Wawa? The sweet cream cheese pretzels or uh, oh, jalapeno God, cheese pretzels? Oh, did you edit the last vlog? Me? From Thursday? Yeah. Uh, no, not yet, no. You said shit. In the back of the camping you, shit. You gonna see what I'm doing no, bro. Did you see that clip that I yeah, had uh, in the camping vid where you, where you turned the <laughs> you turned the phone? <laughs> you a dickhead. You, you a dickhead. That's all these niggas down here. Be right back, yo. Be out here. Shout out, Lee. Eight fifty. Dude, that's the price of it. Yeah. Eight fifty. Seven fifty. That's really not that bad. For this. How much is this? This shit hot. It's too flashy for me, man. Bro, you could rock this, bro. Too you want to wear this shit? Yo, chat. Would y'all wear this shit? I'm saying chat like I'm on live or something. Oh, bait is played out too. I ain't gonna lie. Bait played. Crossbody bags. Nah, it's, well, it's no set. As a travel oh, bag, I grabbed that. I ain't gonna lie, that shit hot. Oh, no, no, yeah, the travel bag hot. Right. On some like, on some like airport picture type shit. Yeah, I told you. Look, one funny. That's cool. This joint tough. How much is this? Five fifty for this. Five fifty. Five fifty for this crazy. It's not too crazy, is it? No. Bro, Actually, God. it is crazy. Dude, these are joints that they will wear. Bro, oh, not these joints. These are joints that the uh, boy Stacks wear. Bro, I, bro, I don't like these joints. The Stussy jeans. I never ever heard of I heard of Stussy jeans, but I ain't never seen a nigga wear them joints. They look like the type of jeans they that you would. not play. Beat play. I just said that. I just said that. Beat played out. Beat played out. Uh, it all depends on what type of beat, though. I didn't play. You didn't answer the question. I didn't play that. Are these shirts dirty? I said duty. These shirts dirty. No, they tweet. Right now, this not part of the brand, is it? Oh, it is part of the brand. Yo, look at this, bro. It's shit on the back of the. This part of the jump. You, I'm dead ass, bro. Look, it's on the front too. It's part of the product. Wait, what time did you pull out? Uh, that, that drum. 
Nah, this is stage bag. I think it got a stain on it. Proud of it. Nah, that's that's crazy as shit. <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy. Look, it's at the top too. <laughs> that's crazy as fuck. Let me see. Uh. Not necessarily. No, I don't think it's central plate. How is that not plate? This shit weird. Okay. I seen somebody do this type of stitching before. Like on the outside type yeah. shit. This kind of hard though, how niggas be doing this. Yeah. That shit hard. But what makes these bitches so expensive? Like, no, this shouldn't be. Oh my god, bro. If I had cheese like that. Ooh, 250. This is too hot. Nah, it's doing too. Me. Ooh, nah, this hard. Right. Just cause my man Jesus on it, you feel me? What is our war jeans? That's hard. What the? Fuck? Jesus. Someone make sure that's actually Jesus. Yeah, it, it is. is. It is. But as y'all can see, uh, we are in a new sneaker store that's down South Street. Um, if y'all wanna come to the store, I'm gonna drop it down in the comments below. Um, I think it's fairly new. So if y'all looking for any sneakers or like any designer pieces or something like that, then y'all can come down here and shop. But let's get a little fit check. Wait. What? Oh, these? You can put this shit together. Was I like this quality better than this? This is same shit. No, it's not. Feel this? Oh shit. Yeah, it's way different. But yeah, let's get a fit check. You got the pink baller club on the head. The goo out putty on the chest, you know what I'm saying? Then we got the super wide um, sweatpants on the legs. Then we got the Jordan ones on the feet, so some light shit. Um, I don't even know if I want to get a spin this, y'all. But um, I might get a fit check this, y'all. If y'all do see that, it's going up on my reels and my TikTok, no. Other than that, oh shit. I almost forgot his camera. Can't forget the camera, brother. What kind of shoes are they again? I'm not I ain't know these ones was that hard. So, or, no, they talk about the holes over the uh, the first slot. Oh, you talking about the uh, fucking thing? Uh, oh. In the song, in the song, they say I want to uh, say the name. Start with the M. What's the brand? You know the junk, the slide, the bench slide. You know what I'm talking about? They got brown, orange, chocolate, and I can't remember. Oh, they got the, uh, the, the furry junk. Yeah. Yeah. I'm trying to think of what y'all talking I got to be able to see them, John. I don't know, but I wasn't going to need one of them. These are junks I was talking about, DD. These right here. I got these, but I don't really I don't really like them no more. Because they get dirty fast. Orange ones is the best one. Yeah. I ain't going to lie. Oh, you want to get with some Yeezy boots, bro? Yo, them junks go for like, uh, at least like five, five baby. 300, that's it? What about the ones with the orange bottom? They got them? Oh, no, they don't. These jumps, these jumps are the shit, bro. Oh, yeah, I just seen them jumps the other day, and they actually sell. Yeah, that's shit, one. That shit hard. That shit. Is this a, uh, a collab? Yeah, this is a Supreme collab. Type shit. Oh, Supreme coming back. Yeah. Oh, my God. These are hard as shit. These are the longest shit, though. They do. They do. They do. So, y'all not wearing these? They're not wearing these? No, bro. Yeah, bro. Niggas is tweaking. I would. Yeah, I niggas would, is tweaking. Man. Niggas is tweaking. You won't wear any of these Asics. I got these. I but none of these, though. Asics, I, I yeah, forgot where these are for Asics. Yeah. Really? Okay. Not even with the right fit. They just burn, right? bro. No, Didi said he wouldn't wear them either. It all depends on what type of ASIC you wear, though. Like, if you wear something like these. Like these, you wouldn't wear these? And I got these, Chet, but it's like... This don't really look like a dance shoe. This? Yeah, niggas is tweaking. I think this is right here. Yeah. What? Oh, it's right there. Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you was to have some like some like uh some Nike some Nike pants on or some like Adidas uh sweatpants with them joints, you wouldn't wear them? You would trip them. Bro, I I need a different so, right, color, right, bro. Right, I'm not right, liking right, the color. Right. Look, 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 right now, look. Yeah. If you get one shoe in here for free, what shoe you got? I'm choosing the flurry, bro. Girl, I'm choosing the easy uh the easy boot. Oh, yeah. Easy boot, easy, bro. Thank God this music not copyrighted. Oh yeah, this is another pair for these. These, these, off white jeans. Yeah, that shit hard. And it's my size too. I like my hard. I like my hard down. Yeah, fours are really nice. Oh, I forgot about these. I like these. Bro, these is nice, bro. No, these jeans just came back out. What are these called? Well, oh, the Jordan DJ? Ford, the uh, the uh, the Firebreds. I think they call the Firebreds. Yeah. Let me know in the comments, yo. What, bro? This is a good fit, right? I don't now. really like them. You so which one you, you like? These better or the the Inverse ones? Out of all the fours, I don't really like these either. I will probably say. Bro, it's right in my color be wet, it's wet with everything. It's the way that they look on the feet. It's like it's the colorway not pleasing. I I got them though, so. Yeah, but I don't really like the color scheme on it though. Damn. I don't really know which fours I picked though. What fours you pick? Yeah, I don't, I don't I know, really I know. Yeah, fours, no, the best ones in, in here. Cause I'm thinking versatility too type shit. I ain't gonna lie, I probably pick these. I probably pick these, yeah. I probably pick these. Yeah, the, yeah. the with this. I call it ketchup and mustard, though. That, no, when I first got them, I didn't fuck with them. I didn't he's fuck tired. with them. He's tired. He's jamming. Hold it up, gang. Bro, that's oh, my bro. I, but this my my problem is is that I got I got it is. No, it be like just tilted. I'm short, bro. I know, I'm saying just like tilted like that. Bro, that's my good. problem is, is that I feel like I got the inverted ones are the ones I actually want. Like I I really don't like these. I really want them like. These. But I got these, and I really don't like these. But I, but, I, but I like these better, and I got these. Why you? Why you don't like these? Because the, like I don't know. Just on my feet, this this looks better way than way than this. Like just looking side to side. It's the same thing, but it's just flipped. it's inverted. I know they're yeah, inverted, it's just but they just it just look better than me. I don't know why. I rather had a black strip rather than the red. So yeah, you right. I rather had it. I'd rather, yeah, I'd rather fuck with the black strip than the red. Yeah. These are the patent leathers I was talking about. These ones. I think it's called, like, I forget what these called. I ain't gonna lie. You fuck with these? Bro, y'all niggas is tripping. Y'all niggas is tripping. Oh, yeah, instead of them, I grab them. They nice. Yeah, these are the ones that look like Travis Scott, but they're not. Yeah, them joints nice. I ain't gonna lie, these burnt. Yeah, these burnt. burnt, these burnt. Y'all burnt these joints off. I'm sorry, y'all burnt these joints. They don't even got my sneaker in here. Do that? Bro, women's colorways are so tough, bro. Like, I ain't gonna lie, this shit is. This shit is ass, bro. You ever wear this, bro? I'm smacking this shit out of your bullshit. Don't worry that shit. I like the cherry reds. I like these. These played out. These played out. Not the reds. The cherry reds not played. I think this is the one you can get away with. These cougars. Uh, oh, I forgot about the space names. These four is hot too. These. Yeah. You see this like Yeezy boots like this would go perfect with like a like a baggy fit because you don't even. You don't even gotta show like the soles. You don't even gotta show this part. All you have to do is show like 
this part and up type shit. I can't do it on camera, but this is like the perfect shoe, bro. I fuck with this. <laughs> what, what, what? I ain't even peeped this whole wall over here. It's Asics. Oh, he's done. Ain't that the, uh, the reverse Kobe Grinch? The green ones look better. I didn't even know they had a whole wall full of Asics. That's crazy. Now that I'm looking at them, I will wear this. All of them, they got the same base color. They look, they all look the same. But they nice though. I fuck with them. I fuck with Asics, y'all. Let me know if y'all fuck with Asics in the comments. Was I gonna shave them down? I was just probably, probably a little bit because like I don't want them to poke out like more than the fit is. You feel me? They fucking around going with the ground. They fucking around going with the Yeah, but I don't want... Yeah, like... I mean... You can cut this down a little bit. A lot, a lot of this is like really unnecessary. It didn't, it didn't like the yin yang sign, that's unnecessary. I don't know why that's there. No, never You you can't wear them with shorts. Those statement pieces. Yes, you could. You cannot wear these with fucking shorts. You cannot wear them with shorts. With these, I like jerks, but I wouldn't wear jerks with these. Or these. Hell no. Hell no. Hell no. <laughs> long socks yo i never really liked these like they cool but they it's doing too much with the shoe these was nice these is nice i just don't want my socks showing through that shit though like yeah no nah. these nice these nice. They burnt them down, though. They cool. I think you could. I, they not to the grade, but they burnt. Yeah. I ain't gonna lie. Niggas burnt up the heater. Yeah. I'm trying to tell you. See, like, bro. I could never in my life, ever, ever in my life. I'm sorry, bro. Depends on what type of fit you're wearing. Man, I can't even see you in them. <laughs> I can't. Man, like 10 minutes, though. 10 minutes to put together a fit? Yeah. No, 15. No, bro. You gotta be rushed. I mean, damn. But wait, you gotta, do you gotta pick it up to actually? Yes. Put all Damn, this is right on the spot though. Them joints nice too. The ones he touching, they nice. No, we going to a concert. Say, say you, say you, say you a rapper. You gotta put on your best fit type shit. You about to have a concert. No, 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 no. The bitches gonna be in the back. You about the to, groupies you about in the back type shit. You about to go on a date, but it's the first date. So she ain't never see you drip before. Type shit. But you don't want to do too much. Cause you don't want. It's up to you. It's up to you. So you, you the nigga on the date. You ready? Come on, ten minutes. Ten minutes. Start with hoodies first. How you gonna tell niggas with the start? Oh, all right, all right, yeah, you right, you right, you right. What you start over with first? Not telling you. I start over with sneaks. Ready? I start over with sneaks. All right. So basically what we got to do is we got to put together an outfit in the next 10 minutes and it got to be fire. So first, bro, I told you I start with sneaks, bro. I told you, bro. I'm over here, nigga. Um, with sneaks, I think, bro, the Chicago one's not ass, bro. You tripping. Yeah, you tripping, bro. You tripping. We need like a, a a really good base color shoe because you don't want to do too much. I'm really about to put y'all on the game. I'm really about to put y'all on some shit. Um, I'd say the perfect shoe, and this is just off my personal favorite type shit. Type shit, my fault, bro. My fault, my fault. But off of what I like, uh, I don't know, y'all. A few moments later. That's it. Break that. Diddy. Or Break that. I'll get this. This ain't really crazy. But on a casual, like first date, I get this a nine. First date, man. All right, Diddy. What's your shirt be? What's your shirt be? Oh, you ain't picking shirts, so you don't get one. Yeah, I was about to. It was either between shirts or hoodie. Question. If me and you was to go on a date, and I wore this pink hoodie, would you like that? Oh, yeah.
Oh, wait, no, Rachel fit, though. Rachel fit. Oh, no, 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 I'm not wearing them. Like, it has clear pants, and you want one of you want to wear it right now. Okay, so she was listening. So, what you rated, though? I would definitely, like, an 8. Like, an 8, you know what you're doing, but... Like just brand wise, we don't like it's not worth seeing all the time. So type shit, type shit. Yeah, spiders every day. Balenciaga only wrong with me every day. Balenciaga See, I wouldn't wear the jeans, but I would probably like me. I would probably wear some like. Would you offer me? I don't know some flare down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like you definitely did. You know what you're doing. Like when it comes to the flare and like the hoodie would be more fitted. Asics are a little bit more form fitting, so it would complement your outfit a little bit. So, right. yeah. so, we, so we all, we all made a fit. Did you rate our fit? Rate your fit? Oh, Lord. Did, did he even what you rate it? Did he? Ew, what are you saying? Yeah, that's what you're talking about. Yeah, I'm just saying. She said this is a 10 out of 10. She didn't even explain it. No, that's your nice dress at night. Bro, he got a chrome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Ye